It's going to be all right, bro. You heard yeah, you just uh, hit me with everything. Yeah. you have any property on your person? If you mind sticking around and take, could you give me one? Take his like wallet, phone, anything like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because we're gonna take him to the Marshalls. Uh, I don't have any property at all. So down the street for my appreciation. First street, and then you're gonna go see a. You're gonna see a judge today, and they're gonna more than like. They'll let me out today. More than like. That's what so I've they're seen. Trying, they're trying to switch it to a federal case. Yes. I was going to LA County Jail. No, 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 no. I just need my hand. You know the time of hearing. I got one more hearing. Yes, yes. Can you hear me? How would I know? Well, they really they, they're trying to switch it to a federal case and they can let me go from there. Uh, yes, Mr. Wonderful. I'll come back out one. Yeah, all right. So if you need to text me, uh, maybe no, you got no, okay. no, That's just a script. I'll give you a second. Don't worry about it, bro. You're going to be good. Those things, they're, they're going to switch it over. You're going to be all right. Bro. Don't worry about it. Don't panic, bro. What's going on with the probation officer? I don't know. Yeah, it's just kind of this similar setup as here. It's like a courthouse. You can just kind of hang your way. So you get, you get a, like a range over there. See a judge. And just federal shirt. Yeah, exactly. But it kind of works just like this. So he'll probably get rained and most likely, um, since there's nothing crazy violent, yeah. they'll probably keep on it. Tell me no. <laughs> uh, uh, see, I want, bro. Don't worry about it. Oh, I appreciate if they give you a van, we're going to get you out today. Yeah. All right? Yeah. 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 Remember my number, right? You got my number remember, memorized, bro? I got it in my pocket. Uh, See you later, bro. Right. Damn, bro. Yo, I ain't gonna lie, man. That shit just hurt my heart, bro. That shit just hurt my fucking heart, bro. I Listen, if you a real nigga, bro, and you understand, and you, and you been through that shit, I been through that shit a few times, bro. Like, I literally seen the concern, the worry, the worrisome, the vibe of just what's going on on this nigga Crip Mac face and his voice, just his tone, his demeanor, him putting his head. Listen, if you ain't never going to court or go to the probation office or whatever, some shit like that, and then you think you finna go home, even if you go to trial, if you have all my niggas that been to trial, even when I went to trial, I thought I was going to go home because motherfuckers won't, the victim wasn't showing up. But if you went through that shit before, bro, you know that feeling, bro. I'm talking about like, bro, I'm really like, this shit fucked me up just now, bro, seeing that footage, bro. And shout out China Mac for spreading the message and, you know what I mean, letting people know, hey, this is a real thing. Now, whatever he got caught with, we don't know. China Mac ain't mentioned that. It, it, that. That ain't even really the subject of this shit right here. This, this, this video is just for all my real niggas who been through that type of shit right there, bro. This nigga about to have a little baby. You know what I mean? He about to have a little baby, bro. And like China, if you go watch the original, matter of fact, I'll put the original video with China Mac describe what happened. Not that one, but the exact video with China Mac describe what happened and how it happened. That it's like it's like it catch you blindsided. You know what I'm saying? Like a ton of bricks. If you if you can't relate to that, y'all niggas shouldn't even fucking say nothing. If you can't relate to that. Shh. If you can't relate to that, shh. If you ain't did no real time or 
been getting locked up all your life and get violating probation and not knowing that you going to court some days and you getting don't shh. If you ain't never spent four, five Christmases, four, five, six uh, 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 Thanksgivings, birthdays, don't even shh. If you ain't spent time away from your kids, substantial amount of time, I mean, anytime substantial, shh. You can't fucking relate. Go move to the move around. Get to the back, nigga. This only for niggas who can relate. This only for real niggas. Fuck your gang. Fuck whatever you represent. It, this ain't nothing to do with that. This only for real niggas. All across the world. All across the whole country. All across the whole world. This is... Bro, only real niggas can relate to that. Bro, I'm really feeling the way. I'm not about to cry, but I can feel it. I, I, I'm looking at this shit and I'm like, oh my God, that's been me. A few times, bro. From going to jail to violating probation to going to prison to all that, bro. You go in thinking one thing, and you got you having shit going on, you have emotion in your life, you having family, you having shit to do, and then it is flip on you like this. That, that's how that's how quick that shit can happen, bro. You know how much learning, you know how many times I had to go through shit like that for me to fucking learn? Too many. Too many, nigga. And I've been off the post since I was 14, nigga. Too many, nigga. That's, 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 man, that's so unfortunate, bro. That shit made me feel even worse for bro. But then, let me, let me say this, bro. So, I wake up today, all right? I, I'm getting ready to, uh, scream, the Young Thug YSL trial and shit, right? So, a fucking video come across my motherfucking timeline that I know for sure I ain't subscribed to this channel. Because if y'all don't know, sometimes YouTube will unsubscribe you. Like, if I, I think it's a certain amount of, sus of subscriptions that you can have, but they be unsubscribing me, I guess, because I be just trying to show love. I just subscribe to somebody's shit, even if they got 200, I don't give a fuck, that shit free. But I'm guessing when you hit, I don't know, I got to look it up, but I'm pretty sure. Because it was for sure it was certain channels that I was subscribed to that I go to their channel. I'm like, oh, shit. I didn't even subscribe. But I know I didn't unsubscribe. So, But this was one of the ones that I, I unsubscribed to on purpose. Right? So I said, how the fuck is this? How did this even come across my timeline? But then I'm like, oh, I forgot. You know, YouTube does that. Users... Like whoever watch your shit or watch what you watching, it's all everything's all in the same type of it's all universes and shit. It depends on what type of what, what type of content you make, what type of content that you, that you watch, that your people watch, whatever. It's your algorithm. Let's just say it like that. So people can get pushed th uh, uh, videos and part whatever. Anything can get pushed into your algorithm, whether you looking at it or not. Maybe if your people looking at it, you know what I'm saying, or people that watching the shit that you watch look at it, it'll suggest it to you. So, and this is a motherfucker that I don't even watch their shit. They corny to me, and I don't even, I really don't even speak on them no more because it's straight sucker shit. Like, you know what I mean? N niggas, not even a nigga, like, respectfully, not, not a trill one, you know what I mean? <laughs> I click on the video, right? And, and let me just, I'm just going to go ahead and say, it's its a milk video, right? This nigga milk, now I don't, like I said, I'm not subscribed, but I i thought this nigga milk won't even on YouTube no more. I seen him pop up on back on Fig the other day, but I'm like, this nigga, I was like, I guess a nigga don't make, because this shit don't get suggested. I ain't seen it. I'm not subscribed, so I ain't, I'm like, damn, I ain't heard nobody talking about it. Today. I'm like, is this nigga alive? Like, oh, I don't know. So this nigga... It looked like this nigga ain't dropped the video in I don't know how long, right? He drops a video on this. This this would make him come out of hiding and drop a video. C Mac and I look at the video before. I, I'm, I, it's almost time for the young thug trial to come on. You know I'm screaming. Shout out to everybody that's been tapping in with the screens. It's almost time, so I'm having a little bit of a little. I got a little time left. Everything set up. My little setup set up. So I said, man, let me just look at this shit. I was kind of just, this is the first time I was like, let me just look at this milk video. It just came, it, I don't know how it popped up in my, my feed, you know what I mean, algorithm, I, I guess. But I said, you know what, maybe, I don't know, I don't, because I, I don't know, maybe, who knows, you know what I'm saying? 
He might have came on there on some real nigga shit. And it was like, a, I don't remember the title said, but it was about C-Mac getting arrested type shit. So he he on this nigga Milk on there. And Milk, that, that, that was some whole ass shit, bro. That's, that's, that's some you, that's kicking a nigga when he down. You ain't even, bro, he on there like, I don't feel sorry for this nigga. And da, da, this, this talking, this, this talking bad about this nigga. This nigga and this nigga got locked up, bro. I know that y'all is arch enemies and arch nemesis. Even though that nigga ain't never laid a finger on him and he ain't never laid a finger on, on him and he ain't never laid a finger on you. You feel me? Niggas too scary to even pop out. He didn't, He told you to pop out 80 million times. You don't ever pop out. You on the calcony. In, in, in my Crip Mac um, voice. You on the fucking calcony. You decide to... Make your your grand return from what I seen. I don't know. Maybe he did make some more videos, but this the first. Like I said, this is the first time I've seen this shit. I didn't. I haven't been subscribed to that shit since fucking a two a year, almost two years probably. Really, yeah, since yeah, since the beginning of me me doing YouTube. Um, and you just you decide to bash this man. Listen, you can you can say whatever you want about C Mac. He whatever. Whatever you want to say, say about him, his mom, or whoever, Lupe, or whoever around. But, nigga, you would never be half a, a nigga like him. First of all, you wouldn't be... A, I'm going to stop saying I'm going to say, say Negro. You you would never be a Negro. You're not a Negro for one. That's what you want to be. You want to be one of us. So he already got you beat at that. But you sitting here making fun of him, and he really got to be outside. You'll be on the calcony. Hey, your word, your word don't hold no merit, bro. You never popped out for nobody. You never popped. The only time you pop out was when back on figure. You probably had anxiety because you know they was gonna back door your love. I don't even want to, you know what I mean? I don't want to talk too crazy. But that shit is weak, bro. That you and I don't, you be thinking that you be like, I'm the Gilligan Slayer. Like you just stomping down on shit and dropping nuts. You just exposing how much of a hoe you is, even more every time. Every time. You, you over here celebrating this, man. I don't care if niggas got... Listen, any real, trill, bro... I got to stop saying that word, that N-word. Any real, trill dude to tell you, bro. One thing, we might laugh. Nowadays, they might laugh when somebody pass away. But you, don't, you, you ain't going to laugh when somebody get sent away. You just ain't... And if you do, you can't relate. You cannot, you can't relate, cause you ain't thugging like that. You ain't never thug like that. You ain't know that. I don't care about old pictures you got. That man went and did bids back to back to back. You know why he had to keep his shit? Allegedly, if that's what he had, I mean, China Mac said he didn't have it. I'm just saying, if he did, hopefully he didn't, cause he really be outside. He be in the field for real. He really, you don't be out there. You, I, I know what you're say. I move strategic, love. Okay, whatever. So why is you talking about somebody who was out and about? That sucker shit, man. That shit weak, bro. I don't respect that shit. And if anybody, I, that's what I'm saying, bro. I really don't even. I didn't even want to bring that dude name up, bro. But when I, it was crazy how I seen that, and then I just now randomly got back in the house from going to get some Chick Fil A sauce, and I seen China Mac on the fucking on the thing. Like, bro, you're lame, my nigga. Like, you're lame, bro. You are lame, bro. Like, you got it. Like, your your head is so messed up. You think, like, the lame shit you do is, like, solid shit. You're basically just an internet. I don't, even want, I don't know what word to say. Cornball. Because I don't even want to say the wrong word. I got a, I got a lot of colorful language. But y'all know they be on my... They be on my bump about that on YouTube. Cause I, I speak clear. I guess the algorithm be the AI be picking up what I say. You that's, that shit is lame, bro. You don't get no points for that, bro. That's like that's like beating up somebody with their hand with their hands behind their back or with no hands or something. That's lame, bro. And you entitled to your own opinion, but I'm like, I just want to let you know that the real Brothers of America, I can't say the N-word, the real brothers of America, we all see stuff like that is super lame, bro. You was already you already had an L. You was already holding big L's. You just got pumped by traffic. See, they was telling me to make a video about that. 
If I said, no, nah, I ain't trying to, I don't want to, because I don't even want to, I don't even want to be in Milk's algorithm or none of that. You know what I mean? But I do understand that we are, we, similar topics. I used to support you. If you know the story, everybody know the story, y'all know the story, but, and I'm not about to get into that, but once I seen that Lange, I was like, oh, man, I thought you was a cool white boy. <laughs> you a Malibu most wanted. You a wannabe. Man, free C Mac, bro. I'm gonna put the link to the um to the videos. I think China Mac said he had a GoFundMe or something. I don't know. I'm gonna put all whatever links I can put down there. Um free C Mac, bro. I hope you can come from up under this. You know what I mean? I know the feeling, bro. That shit hurt. It hurt. I know he hurt right now. I know his heart hurting right now. Like, damn. But you know, in contrary, not to not to say he's squeaky clean, you know. You make you make choices. You make your bed. You gotta line it. You know you walk with that iron. You live a certain way. You know it can happen. But real people can see through and look at C Mac and say he just like um China Mac say he not a bad guy, bro. He not a bad guy. Now it's some people that don't like him. You know what I'm saying? Certain people that don't like him. But if you if you really from the streets, you know what a you know what a heinous. MF look like. I gotta start editing my, my you know what I mean? You know what a heinous moth could look like. You know what it look like. I'm talking about heinous. I ain't talking about just a regular street. I'm talking about like a super duper crazy savage. So take away the tattoos. C Mac ain't that. Look look at his personality. Outgoing. Them type of niggas ain't even outgoing. <laughs> AKA, them niggas can't go out. Them because you can't even take nowhere. You can't take them to no podcast. Take them to no Disney World or do no blog with them and no vlog with them. See, Mac ain't that, bro. He just got some issues. He's not fully developed as or as developed as others. That's just what it is, bro. For whatever reason. I ain't here to diagnose nothing. Free C Mac, man. Y'all let me know what you think, man. Like, comment, subscribe, notification bell. I'm gone. Yeah. Hey, what it do, what it do, man. I appreciate you making it this far in the video. Please, please, please do me one solid. Go below to the link in the description and follow my second channel, IQ Shahid's Revenge. We on the road to 5K. Yeah.